In this video we put together the registers. Let's start with the structure. We take the gate component and the flip-flop component and connect them together. We lead both bus pins to the outside. We also route the out pin to the outside so that we can always see the current value. We take read and write and connect them to the output of an and gate. The write is still connected to the set of the flip-flop. There will be a third input, this will be for the beat. This circuit ensures that only reading or writing can take place. Now we create the new component. We translate the circuit into code. With one exception, we don't use a flip-flop but save the data directly. Now let's put together a circuit made up of three registers. Here we use two multiplexers to address source and destination registers. The free combination 00 simulates external memory. We're testing now. First we write an initial value into each register. Now we move the data from register to register. In the next video we will build a clock generator. 